now for the National Weather Service Marine Forecast for the northern Chesapeake Bay and adjoining estuaries north of North Beach. Rest of today, east winds 10 knots with gusts to 20 knots. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Patchy drizzle late this morning. Tonight, east winds 5 to 10 knots. Waves 1 foot. Sunday, southeast winds 5 knots. Waves less than 1 foot. Sunday night, southwest winds 5 knots. Waves less than 1 foot. A chance of showers. Monday, north winds 10 to 15 knots. Waves 2 feet. A chance of showers in the morning. Tuesday through Wednesday, southwest winds 10 to 15 knots. Waves 1 to 2 feet. This is a statement from the National Weather Service. Small craft advisory remains in effect until 6 p.m. this evening. East winds 10 to 15 knots with gusts up to 20 knots. The areas affected include Chesapeake Bay from North Beach, Maryland to Smith Point, Virginia, Tangier Sound and the inland waters surrounding Bloodsworth Island, Choptank River to Cambridge, Maryland and the Little Choptank River, and Tidal Potomac from Cobb Island, Maryland to Smith Point, Virginia. The hazardous weather conditions are expected until 6 p.m. this evening. Impacts, conditions will be hazardous to small craft. Inexperienced mariners, especially those operating smaller vessels, should avoid navigating in hazardous conditions. The 11 a.m. observation in Baltimore. At BWI Airport, partly sunny skies. The temperature was 72 degrees. 2.60. Humidity was 66%. Winds were east at 16 miles an hour and the barometric pressure was 30.26 inches and steady. Now for some observations from the surrounding area. At Annapolis, the temperature was 71. Winds east at 12 miles an hour. At Martin State Airport, partly sunny. Temperature 72 degrees. East wind at 9, gusting to 17. At Westminster, the temperature was 72. Winds east at 6 miles an hour. At Washington National Airport, cloudy, 71 degrees, east wind at 8. At Pawtuxet River Naval Air Station, partly sunny skies, it was 75, east wind at 12 miles an hour. At Salisbury, partly sunny skies, it was 73, wind east at 9 miles an hour. At Ocean City, partly sunny skies, it was 73 degrees. East wind at 14, gusting to 21. At Dover, partly sunny, 72 degrees. Winds east at 15. At Wilmington, mostly sunny skies. It was 70. Wind east at 9 miles an hour. At York, cloudy skies. It was 66. Wind east at 9 miles an hour. At New York, partly sunny skies. 68. Wind east at 12 miles an hour. At Philadelphia, mostly sunny skies, 71. Wind east at 14 miles an hour. At Raleigh, fog was reported, 72. Wind east at 15 miles an hour. Now for some observations on the waters. At Colchester Beach, the wind was east at 8 knots and the water was 78 degrees. At Francis Scott Key Bridge, the wind was east at 15 knots, gusting to 17. Thomas Point was 70 degrees, the wind was northeast at 14 knots, gusting to 15, and the water temperature was 78 degrees. At Goose's Reef Buoy, the temperature was 72 degrees, and the water temperature was 79 degrees. At Co Point, wind east at 12 knots, at 15 miles east of Fenwick Island. This is the NOAA Weather Radio All Hazards Station KEC 83, broadcasting from the National Weather Service Office in Sterling, Virginia, and transmitting on a frequency of 162.400 MHz from an antenna located in Pikesville, Maryland. Here is a look at the weather features that will affect the region over the next several days. A cold front will remain stalled to the south over the Carolinas this afternoon and tonight while high pressure briefly builds into our region through early Sunday. The frontal boundary will return north as a warm front Sunday. A cold front will approach and pass through our region Sunday afternoon and into Monday, bringing the next chance for precipitation. Canadian high pressure builds into the region for the middle parts of next week, bringing drier and much less humid conditions. Now for the official National Weather Service forecast for the Baltimore metro area and
in the surrounding KEC listening area. Rest of today, mostly cloudy late this morning, then becoming partly sunny. Patchy drizzle late this morning. Highs in the mid-70s. East winds around 10 miles an hour with gusts up to 20 miles an hour. Tonight, partly cloudy until midnight, then becoming mostly cloudy. Lows in the lower 60s. East winds 5 to 10 miles an hour. Sunday, partly sunny. A chance of showers in the afternoon. Highs around 80. East winds around 5 miles an hour, becoming south in the afternoon. Chance of rain 40%. Sunday night, mostly cloudy with a 50% chance of showers. Lows in the upper 60s. South winds 5 to 10 miles an hour, becoming west after midnight. Monday, mostly clear. Highs around 80. Tuesday, mostly clear. Highs in the lower 70s. Lows in the lower 50s. Wednesday, mostly clear. Highs in the mid 70s. Lows in the upper 50s. Thursday, partly cloudy. Highs in the upper 70s. Lows around 60. Friday, partly cloudy. A 30% chance of showers. Highs in the mid 70s. Lows in the upper 50s. This hazardous weather outlook is for the Maryland portion of the Chesapeake Bay, tidal Potomac River, and adjacent counties in central Maryland and northern Virginia as well as the District of Columbia. Day 1, today and tonight. No hazardous weather is expected at this time. Days 2 through 7, Sunday through Friday. No hazardous weather is expected at this time. Spotter information statement, spotter activation is not expected at this time.